I'm really interested in creating a superb workplace for every single member of Mercy staff and faculty, ensuring that Mercy is a phenomenal workplace. This is something I believe in very strongly. We can work really hard, but we can also be kind to each other and compassionate. We can take care of each other through difficult times. If we learned anything through COVID, it's that we need each other and we need to be able to count on each other. And we're at our best serving our students when we work in a place that respects each of us, regardless of our background and our gifts and our our talents and our role at the institution. The things that I think about with regard to student success are on-time graduation, very high rates of retention, so keeping students year to year, and that when students graduate, they go into meaningful careers in fields that they're excited about, where they can have a purpose and fulfill their own goals and objectives. We have got to get students across the stage and into their professions and careers faster. You know, nationally, we know that graduation rates are lower than they should be. And I think we have a very serious opportunity and responsibility to serve our students in a way that gets them out the door. Every student, regardless of their situation, should have an exceptional experience here. Every student, every time, no exceptions. And I think that that will require us to be really intentional about how we create a community of belonging for everyone. Students have very different experiences here, and they, they come to us with very different gifts and very different needs, and we need to provide them with individualized solutions for what they're doing. It's critical for us to understand that we cannot have a cookie-cutter approach. Students need different things, and we've got to meet them where they are and support them with what they need individually. Mercy shall now and forever be named Mercy University. Changing the name is really a way of acknowledging the breadth of the institution. And in my mind, Mercy has been a university for many years. And, you know, we have rich graduate programs that are, you know, very successful. And so this name change is a recognition of the work that the college community has been doing for years. I think that it's a better representation of what Mercy really is. If you read the papers and listen to the news, you know, everyone understands that our country is struggling to believe that that earning a college degree is worthwhile. And I think that, um, you know, to be honest, this makes me very sad because I'm one of the people whose lives were completely transformed by earning my undergraduate degree. And you know, the research is so clear that there is no better way to achieve economic mobility than to earn a degree. And so I think that the challenge is that higher ed has not done a good job of explaining the value proposition and of, you know, sharing the data in ways that are meaningful and understandable. But, you know, we have to tell the story of our students who work so hard and are able to get great jobs and take care of their families and earn what they need to, to live comfortably because of what college provides them. And the transformative power of college has not changed. 